Hi everyone, I'm Dan. In this video I'm going to show you how to use a motion stretch deformer for Cinema 4D. Uh, I'm going to show you quickly on this sphere which I've just uh, animated across like this. If I apply motion stretch then click pre-cache. We have to pre-cache it because it's looking forwards and backwards in time to figure out how to apply the stretch and then play around with this frame width which controls how far forwards and backwards in time we want the stretch to occur then play through and we see we've got a trail uh, created by the animation of our sphere Joe Winston generously lent me these great ninja animations which he's uh, designed and animated and I'm gonna apply motion stretch to them uh, I've already got it here after the skin inside the body. Um, we thought it might be a good idea to apply it just to the legs and I'll show you how to do that, how to selectively apply it using uh, point selections. So if I select the body here, I've already selected the legs and I just need to go uh, to select, set selection and that creates a point selection tag for me. I can use that in a restriction tag on the deformer. Apply that there. This works with any of the Cinema 4D's built-in deformers as well. And now when I pre-cache uh, we can see that the legs here are being stretched out by motion stretch as the arms and head are left alone. Uh, so this also shows that uh, you can use me, uh, motion stretch to create some fun uh, tune motion blur effects on your character animations. This is another one of Joe's ninja animations. This ninja is jumping up and throwing some stars. Um, one of the things Joe discovered, which is very handy, is that if you put all the uh, all of your character geometry inside a connect, you can apply motion stretch to the connect instead of having to apply it to each object individually. So now if I pre-cache that again I'll take the frame width up to a few frames. Now we can see that the whole lot stretched out even though originally these were all separate parts. Here's a comparison of Joe's Ninja running with and without the motion stretch. If you want to see any more of Joe's character designs or animations, you should check out his site at josephwinston.com. The demo of motion stretch is available now at www.curiousanimal.tv. Thanks.